This is about Chicago Talks, our community and citizen news website. When Blogger was launched in 1999, some people thought blogging was a new form of writing. Professor Iverson thought blogging was a verb, not a noun, and nothing less than a publishing revolution. You know, a blog is nothing but a database with a pretty face. And blogging software is simply a content management system. Chicago Talks takes advantage of the ease and affordability of using a content management system like WordPress to publish news about Chicago communities of place, communities of interest, and hot button local issues. We're a do-it-yourself operation. You post a story to our editing queue. From there, our graduate student editors set up the story budget, revise, edit, work with the reporters, and publish stories on an ongoing basis. We leave the if it bleeds, it leads to the mainstream media and try to cover stories that matter to people where they live. Chicago Talks began in 2006 as a project of Barbara Iverson and Professor Suzanne McBride with support from the Journalism Department and the Knight Foundation. Back in the beginning, we had to twist arms to get reporters to understand that an edited online publication was real reporting and real publishing. Today, Chicago Talks and its cousin, Austin Talks, are hubs of publishing in our department. They're well known throughout the news community in Chicago and the whole US. Students learn to use a content management system um, when they write for Chicago Talks and they learn to write with links, they learn to incorporate multimedia in their stories, they learn to promote their own stories. All of these are marketable skills. Each reporter gets a customized web page with links to all the stories they've published on Chicago Talks that they can use in their resume or in their portfolio. We doubled our unique page views between 2009 and 10, and every year since we've picked up at least 10,000 a year. Our daily eyeball count doubled in our first year and we're at about 400 views per day now. Between March 22nd and April 22nd, we had 4,000 unique visitors. Today, a popular story on our site gets about 200 views. Students in our beginning reporting classes have opportunities to write for Chicago Talks right as part of their classes. After that, students are free to contact us and work with us for story ideas and story leads, or they can simply submit stories to the site. We encourage students to try video if they're usually writers, and vice versa. We've won prizes for investigative reporting. We've worked with reporters covering NATO and helped them live stream their work. We published stories live from McCormick Place when Obama won his second term. And we're looking all the time for new opportunities. Chicago Talks is open to anyone as long as the subject is Chicago-centric. Read, subscribe, write, and talk to Chicago Talks.